I love using Aquaviews in down view mode. Simply pointing it down to the bottom, you can watch what fish are doing down there. There's a lot of different modes. You could run it straight forward and look at the fish sideways, but I like to look at them from their backs. I want to see them take the hook, how they react to the hook. And how do you do this? Just unhook it from all different, anywhere that you could hang in there. You don't even use it. Just put it like that. Don't, I don't put it way down right next to them. Put it just above them. Give them some space. Fish are very aware of what's going on in their surroundings. So I just put it down the hole a little ways. Some lakes in shallow water, I leave it in the hole because there's fish coming right up to the bottom of the hole. So here I'm gonna set it down just a few feet. And as I'm dropping it in, you can see the weeds below. That's perfect. I can see the weeds. I could drop my lure right below and watch the lure. I'm using a little Northland sliver spoon. I'm gonna put it below there. It's got a nice little flicker snell. You'll see it on the camera. There it is. You'll see there's weeds on the bottom and just awesome environment for perch. Perch in late ice and the spring love weeds. This is where they come to uh, spawn. This is where they lay their eggs. Uh, but you'll notice in the down view mode, I don't miss anything. I, I got uh, nice visual all around my lure and it's just waiting for the, the schools to come in. You could drill out the whole area or you could let them come to you quietly and uh, big perch are spooky, so you don't want to make too much noise. All right, I love that, watching them, and then setting the hook, reacting to how they take the bait. This is great. Just love watching these things strike on the hook, watching them on my Aquaview. You know, when you're out fishing perch, perch do not like bare uh, structure on the bottom. They like to have something down there, and uh, whether it's vegetation, rocks, or even emergent vegetation, submergent or emergent vegetation is always a good bet. I found weed beds in this area uh, and most of them are dead, but there's still some stalks laying sideways in the bottom. Just enough cover for crayfish to be under, minnows to swim around, and some of it has a little green in it. So finding a little vegetation on the bottom is very important, uh, especially late ice for perch. Perch live in deep water all winter. When late ice, they like shallow and they love weeds. One thing about uh, Aquaview, the innovators in underwater camera technology is this new HD. They truly, truly came up with a home run on this camera. This is actual high definition technology because you could actually see crystal clear images in, in lakes normally that have a little bit of a stain to them. Perfectly clear and even in darker water, I could see fish. Love this unit and I plan on using it everywhere. Can't wait to try it in places where normally you couldn't even use a camera. All right, that's what I like. Fun watching them hit. <laughs> wow, awesome. Watched them in HD, strike, and here he is now.